Hey, what's up guys? Welcome to Windows3.4.com. In this video, we're going to talk about another BSOD error. And in this video, I'm going to show you how to fix the maximum weight objects exceeded. This is a very annoying BSOD error, but hopefully after watching this video, you're going to be able to solve the problem. <music> Firstly, we're going to have to run the SFC scanner by going to the search box and then type in here CMD. Right click on command prompt and run as administrator. Once command prompt appears, you're going to have to type in here SFC space slash scan now. Then press enter and the SFC scanner will start. This scan will uh, try to locate all your important system files and fix all the issues if there are any. And this way you can be able to fix the problem. But if not, stay in this video because I'm going to show you a few other solutions. Another solution would be to update your drivers. I'm going to show you a program called Driver Updater. This program helps you install all your drivers. Maybe you have outdated drivers. Maybe you have missing drivers. This program will help you do that. You're going to have the link for this program in the description down below. You just select the drivers that you want to be installed and click on update. And lastly, it's very important to have your windows up to date. So to update windows, you're going to have to go to the start menu and then click on settings. And there here in settings, you're going to have to go down to update and security. And in the windows update tab, windows will tell you if there are any updates available and will download the updates for you and will install them when you're ready. Hopefully after trying all this, your problem is now solved and the BSOD error is not occurring anymore. So this was the video guys, don't forget to leave a like if you enjoyed it and subscribe to the channel with the notification bell activated so you won't miss any future uploads. Also don't forget to leave a comment down below with problems that you have on your Windows operating system and we can try to solve your issue in the next video. Until next time, have a nice day.